The water energy nexus, or the interrelationship between water and energy, is becoming an increasingly important topic. First, there is water for energy. It takes a substantial amount of water to generate, transport, store, and use energy. Then, there is energy for water. It takes a significant amount of energy to collect, clean, move, store, use, and dispose of water. However, most research done on this relationship is at a coarse resolution. For example, how much water is being consumed in thermoelectric power plants in California, or how much energy do wastewater treatment plants use each month. Our research evaluates the water energy nexus at a fine resolution and at the end use, using customer level water and electricity consumption data. Using statistical methods and machine learning techniques, we are uncovering new relationships between the two natural resources across different time scales and within residential, commercial, and industrial sectors. One topic that we are investigating is how conservation and efficiency measures aimed at one commodity impact use in the other. For example, given the current drought across the western United States, many water utilities are incentivizing residential and commercial customers to remove their traditional turf lawns through cash for gas programs. However, wide-scale vegetation removal can also create an urban heat island effect, increasing peak energy demand as customers use more air conditioning. Through our research, we hope to increase knowledge of urban water and energy use patterns while providing useful information to decision makers that can help them better understand demand, policy implications, and management techniques.